out of the Pace Studios. We are live right now with Francis Cohn. It is great to see all of you again. Thanks for coming back. Good to see you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We recorded, uh, I, think it, I think it was one of the first uh, session series that Bob and I worked on. This was back in 2015 at the, uh, at the, the very last CMJ. It was, mm-hmm. I think, the first time we, we crossed paths and then one time since then. And this is, here we go, round three. Nice. Yeah. Thanks for having us back. Yeah, 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 of course. Um, so can you tell us about what you guys are going to play today? I know, so Late Risers coming out um, January 18th on 30 Tigers. Mm-hmm. Are are you going to play all stuff off Late Riser, or are you going to go throughout the catalog and play different things? I'm going to surprise you. Perfect. <laughs> the first three are from the record, yeah. Okay. Um, the first song just came out last Friday. Oh, that's right, because so you guys you are going to do bonus song today right we're gonna do a quick bonus good good um but yeah the first song's called failure and it just came out as a single and then one more single will come out in january and then the record's out on the 18th outstanding we'd love to hear it ready set our failure to the room Sounded great. Thank you. Um, so you are just recently off the road with with Tall Heights. You're supporting them uh, for some amount of time. Um, they were just in here the other day. What day is it today? Was it yesterday? I don't know. They were here very Saturday? recently. Friday? Friday. Yeah, they came through. That was fun. 
Um, and so can you tell us a little bit about how that went? Tour was great. It was um, the longest tour we've ever been on. Yeah. Um, but there, they were just incredible and so generous. And how long were you out? Seven weeks. Um, it was wonderful. We did the whole country, looped around the middle a little bit. Did you do the 15-passenger van thing or a, or a bigger vehicle? 15-passenger. Oof, seven weeks. We got Hyatt cards and stayed in a ton of Hyatt hotels. It was my trick for all the bands listening. You get those cards, you get those points, and you stay in those hotel for free. hotels for free. I know it's not morning, but it feels like morning in my head. And it's in my body. T- 11, 11 p.m. is is early enough. I mean, yeah. I'd, I'm not feeling fully with it. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're fine. I'm trying. I'm trying my my very best. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, tour was fucking awesome. Um, and we love those guys. And Old Sea Brigade opened up, too, and they're really wonderful people. Nice. So. Well, congratulations. I'm good. glad that happened, and yeah. I'm glad you had a good long tour and are back yeah. safely. And um, can you tell us a little bit about, so this is another one that you're going to do off of Late Riser, right? Mm-hmm. Can you tell us about this one? This song I always like live and shows every night, hesitated to say what it's about because it's a, it's darker than like what it seems to be. Um, it's just about fear of like, Losing your mind too early, like fear of dementia. <laughs> it's <laughs> well, really dark. The, as opposed to losing your mind <laughs> it, at the right time. It's at, at the right time, which would be just like when you're gone. Yeah. Um, but it sort of sounds like a love song, so I let it exist mostly as that. But now I just said it. So good luck to everyone this morning, this afternoon. I don't know when it is. Oh, God. <laughs> it's happening. <laughs> <laughs> You made a mockery of You made a mockery of
that sounded great. Yeah, thank you. Um, well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> but not because of that. yeah, just overall existentially, it's it's that way for me. But yeah, now I'm a little more depressed. So cool. Well done, <laughs> thank you. No problem. <laughs> um, um, can we talk a little bit about the band's relocation? So when we met, you were a Brooklyn band. And uh, probably still in some ways are a Brooklyn band at heart, um, but you don't live in Brooklyn any longer. You guys relocated down in Asheville. Mm -hmm. And can you talk a little bit, bit about if, if at all, the sound of the band has changed since that relocation and since you've been collaborating with um, Nashvillians? Is that true of the Lucius guys? Is Dan Malata a, a Nashville dude or is he just from wherever? He's from L.A. Uh, he's okay. Dan Malad in LA and Josh Kaler in Nashville. And Josh, he was mostly engineering. Well, let's uh, pretend like I didn't say the part about Dan Malad and in relation to Nashville, but so <laughs> the r relating with and collaborating with Nashville characters has that, do you feel like that shaped the sound of this record in a different way than it would have had you nope. done it in Brooklyn? <laughs> You guys, we you, record, you just sound how you sound wherever you record? Well, we recorded half of this record while we were living here but in Nashville with Josh Kaler. So he produced it with Dan Malad. And um, so, yeah, once we were there, I mean, some of the songs that we ended up moving there and recording, I'd written up here. So there wasn't really a... Um, we didn't discover any Nashville twang. <laughs> Um, not that that's all the, that's there. There's yeah, a lot. I just wear a cowboy hat now. Yeah. Andy exclusively wears a cowboy hat on the streets of Nashville. But other than that, I think we um, have kept the thing that we do. I don't know what it is, but we, I think, have kept it. Well, you fit right in. Good for you. Did you bring any cowboy hats up here? No, I wouldn't dare. <laughs> I think a cowboy hat in the in New York City is a nice juxtaposition that makes people say, huh, look at that guy. Huh, where'd that cowboy go from? Wish I also had a cowboy hat. <laughs> Make it cowboy. Yeah. We'll, bring, we'll bring you a cowboy hat. Uh, if you bring me a cowboy hat, I would be endlessly overjoyed. <laughs> I'll wear it. I've got a gigantic head, though. It's like, it's like eight inches. Me too. I'll give it a good measure before we leave. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so we are doing number three and number four. And so this one is, this is again from Late Riser. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to go into the song that is yeah. not in on Late Riser. And um, so can you tell us a little bit about this one? Yeah, this is the only one that we recorded in L.A. in Danny's attic in a day. And most of the recording is the first take. Is that the name of a recording studio, or is, or is it Danny's Danny Malad, Attic? Dan no, Malad's Attic. Now he has a studio, a real one that might have a name. It was in his short, like the ceiling was so low that I, I, I broke a light bulb with my head. Yeah, Andy broke a couple of light bulbs that yeah. day. I hope Just he calls know. the proper studio Danny's Attic. <laughs> <laughs> Danny, if you're listening.
So, the grand surprise, the, the big reveal here is... The song's called Leave Without You. Okay. Does it, exist, it. <laughs> does it exist in the world yes. anywhere, or is this the first time that it's being played? It does exist on Spotify. Okay. And other streaming services. On a previous Such album, a or is this a new one that's it's potentially a on a forthcoming world. album? Yeah. Stands on its own. Just stands on its own out there. Cool. Was this uh, Malad or the other fella related? Um, we recorded it in Nashville with Josh Kaler, and we um, mixed it here with Justin Garish. You know Justin Garish? Love that guy. So it's called Leave Without You. Thanks for having us, guys. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for coming. Great to see you again. After all this time, all this time. 
Thank you so much. Thanks. Right. Thank you. That sounds great as always. And um, so we've got there's no no tour dates to announce yet, but they will be on the on the website, on the Facebook, everywhere you expect tour dates to be as soon as they are announced. And uh, I hope they're soon. And I'll come I'll come see you. So great. we'll yeah we'll see you at the we'll show hopefully. Yes, please, please, please. Any hat will do. It doesn't even have to be a cowboy hat. It can be a, a, I was going to say Stetson, but that is a cowboy hat, isn't it? Yeah. Let's let's make it a Stetson. Yeah. We'll make it a Stetson. (laughs) I have one of these, but I dropped this in a dirty puddle of like pigeon piss and fried rice last night. So I can use a new one of these. Okay. Wow. Um, and back on topic, thank you so much for coming through. Late Riser is the name of the album. It's coming out January 18th on 30 Tigers. And so thank you for previewing three songs off of it. And thank you for the fourth song as well. And um, have travel safely as tour dates are announced. And thanks so much for coming back. Cool. Yeah, thanks, thanks, for thank thanks for having us. Thanks for having us. Thanks, Bob. So much.